Hey there, Simplifiers. Today, it's a little bit different format. We won't be tackling any important organizing issues because I was tagged, well, kind of tagged, in a silly question challenge by Meg Kearns, who you can find here, I think, or maybe here. I'm not quite sure. And so here are my answers to the 10 silly questions. A penguin walks through the door and is wearing a a penguin walks through the door wearing a sombrero. What does he say and why is he here? He's here because I invited him to come drink margaritas with me. Duh. What would your autobiography be called? Probably something like, sometimes I have my shit together and sometimes I don't. Would you let us hook up your recently played list on Spotify to the office speakers. I don't really listen to music and it drives my husband crazy. Um, we have Napster, what up 1999 Colin. Uh, I don't really listen to music. I'm kind of an NPR and sports talk radio junkie. So I don't even have Spotify. If you had three wishes from a non-tricky genie, stop. If you had three wishes from a non-tricky genie, what would they be? Okay, so I love to travel. So the ability to travel wherever I want, whenever I want, sparing no cost or no time or job restrictions, that my friends and family would always be healthy and, uh, Maybe that we all could get along? Is that way too like hippy dippy of me? Oh well, I don't care. Where would you go in a time travel machine and would you stay? Okay, so there might be a couple. Um, I really like ancient Rome. I am a huge, huge Shakespeare buff, so I would love to travel back. Um, to Shakespearean times and you know I've always been really interested in like the 50s and 60s and the changing of America then so I probably you know maybe want to stop there too um, would I stay no because um, I just like my modern conveniences too much um, invisibility or flight uh, I'd ha probably have to go fly because I like to get places fast um, so flying seems like it would get me there faster than a car some days after somebody uses a transporter in Star Trek, are they the same person or does reconstituting them out of different molecules mean that they're a different person and the original version ceases to exist? Different. What would you name a boat if you had one? My boat would be called the Q&A because it's my kids' initials and I would paint cute little question marks and exclamation points and um, punctuation marks all over the back of the boat. To you, what is the closest thing to real magic? It's what I'm gonna do when I'm done with this video, when I whip up some sort of semi-nutritious dinner out of the nothing that we currently have in our kitchen cupboard. Would you take a one-way trip to Mars? Absolutely not. I would miss my family and friends way too much and I just really don't care about what's out there that much. So there you have it. There are my 10 silly questions. If you have a silly question for me or you want to answer one of these questions, please comment below and be sure to subscribe. And let's see, let's put it, we'll put it here today. So you don't miss any of my organizing ABCs or organizing tips and tricks to help simplify you and your family's lives. Happy organizing and I'll catch you next time on Organizing with Simple Solutions.